this is Gallon Gamer here and welcome to a leisurely road trip. Well of course it isn't, it's a mod review for the Extra Grippy Tires mod. Which can turn any of your cars into a jelly car. So, let's reset. I have prepared some vehicles here and they can do some pretty special things. First off, this T-Series. It has got the adjustable extra grip tires installed and it will, indeed, if I can actually drive, then it will indeed flip over by the turn of the wheel. So, we have looked at the D-Series. Let's look at this. So you might be thinking, this is just a normal Grand Marshal, and it does look like it, but it has extra grip tyres installed, and they are adjustable. So, I'll set up a car, well the next one, to show you what you can do with customizability. Now, we have this. Sounds normal, but I can, indeed, put it into slow-mo, rev it up, and then watch what it does. It will indeed wheel it, at least for a bit. Because this is a sleeper car. So now just to maneuver over here, and neutral drop it. And it takes off. So yeah. This is some of the things you can do with it. And now just to achieve flight and absolutely smash up the car. Okay, for the next one. Here we have a seemingly normal Gavril Blue Book. But first, we shall spawn up a new car. To show you how to set up your extra of tires. So we want, let's say, we just want a Hirochi Sunburst. So we select our Hirochi Sunburst, put it, make it a sport variant, click spawn new, or replace current if you just want to have one car. Now, here we go. So let's assume you want to make this a car that rolls over really easily. So basically a jelly car. You want to go, to your suspension, to your wheels, and then go for the front tires. And here you'll see extra grip sport front tires, or extra grip rally front tires. So I will now select the extra grip sport front tires. And I'll do the same for, for the rear. But now, if I just try to drive this, in first gear obviously, And obviously, obviously turn the hindering ESC off. It does not flip. And why is that, you ask? Because you need to adjust it. Now, let me just go into the tuning menu and go for wheels. Front rear and then front tire friction. You can put this to all, basically times 100% its friction. Now, if we just go in, we will wheel spin anymore. And just to turn, it does feel a lot more jelly like. And now, to give it some welly, it will flip over. So, that is how you configure your extra grip tyres. And the higher the bar goes, the more likely your car is to flip. And now, what have I done with this little covert here? It's still stuck, except the front tires and the brakes. So, you can indeed do donuts, sort of. But what this thing can also do is, when you accelerate and then brake sharply, it can lift its booty. 
Yes, very well indeed. I have now built a stuffy car. And you can surely make it do reverse wheelies. But this is not what I want to do. I just want to stop it. So now, let's keep falling ahead. And let's go 100 kilometers an hour and slam on the brakes. It can indeed flip over. So now we have three destroyed cars. Let's look at this D series, which you have already seen in the intro. It is a German car, just like the Hirochi Sunburst. And it will do exactly that. It will, now let me just activate slow motion. It will flip over and smash itself to bits. So, quite cool, isn't it? And now for another example, we have this hopper here. And it is also equipped with extra good tires. I shall now go, and go ahead and turn. And you might see it lifts a wheel. The grip is so good on these tires, you can do this. There is nothing underneath that wheel. It's just the grip from the other tire that's pushing it up. And it can also do wheelies. So now, let me just dem, well, let me get to a straight bit of road and demonstrate its wheeling capabilities. And it can also do off-road like this very well and don't flip it. So, now we're here. I shall back up and wheelie. Of course it flips over because the rear, because the rear suspension destroys itself. But let's just try that again. Reverse and then slammed into drive and then it can and will probably do a wheelie. And yes, yes it flips over too. So, we have a bunch of flipped cars and this blue book that hasn't been flipped yet. So, I haven't shown you this blue book yet. It is basically a mix between both. It will do very good cornering on extra grip tires but these aren't on 100% like you might think. No, these are at 5%. It's just 5% of, well, five times multiply the grip, but it will still roll over and go to a review, which I shall now put on slow-mo and watch it tumble, because you need some quality content, you know? Go download it if you want to have fun and bye bye.